Hello and welcome to another FS19 mod review. This time we're taking a look at the Kivon Discator 12 disc cultivator. So fresh on the mod hub. And it looks a decent mod. It's nice to have another 12 meter cultivator in the game. Textures all look good. Extremely shiny bolts on there. So you can see dynamic hoses, four of. Um, no light cable, but hoses. Is there any light cable in there anywhere? Doesn't seem to be. Five hoses. Not four, five. Looking good there. Wheels and tyres look decent on here, as does the detail on the disc unit itself. So two rows of discs with a spike tooth pack on the back. It needs 380 horsepower, so we've got the Axion 960 here with 445. It should do the job nicely for us. So spec that up with GPS, and the GPS is set to the width of the cultivator, so we'll be using it with that. But it looks a decent mod. So I know a <clears throat> few people will be wondering how you pronounce that is Kivon. So we were assured many years back when we were looking at them in real life. So we'll take this up to the field and uh, try it. Let's just watch the fold animation of it. Make sure everything stays attached. Which it looks too. Folds in and hooks in the racks there. So we'll check the lights on the back of this once we're in the tractor. <coughs> so indicators. Rear lights. Reversing lights and brake lights. So let's get this up through a big field and try it. It does look a decent mod. Do a few sharp turns with it just to find out how tight top heavy it is. <clears throat> Looks like the sort of machine was going to be top heavy. See the detail on all the uh, scalloped discs there. The cutaway discs. Don't believe there's any other functions to this machine? No. Just swing to it here and see if it turns over or not. Yes, so we, you'll need to be careful this one. I had a feeling it would do. Come on, it had to be done just to check that. Look like every Thing in game, the physics of the game doesn't allow them to be stable at speed when turning. So the reason I've got GPS on this is so we can actually a check all functions with it. And B it gives me a chance to leave this on autopilot if you like, so we can actually have a look at what the cultivator does. Once it decides where it wants to drive to. Nice detailing in there. Throw the soil going up. So that all seems to work nicely. Get on the helper going back across the field. Actually, check the help is going to work properly with it basically. After what happened with the Lemkin Cultivator last week, it's a good one to check. So, this is set for 12 meters.
is now on helper. So we'll hop out in the middle of the field here. Just watch what it's going to do. Okay, so far. So it's folding the ground, following the ground. Okay. As long as the helper turns towards us, we're fine. We'll um, uh, just take over ourselves with that helper. We found the AI without the eye bit again. And our straw stack is on the move down there. back on and see where it's going to go. In a straight line, so it's not going to try and follow the uh, grid lines. It's probably going to miss a small piece here, because we're out position done. Spot there. So we no issues with that at all, so we'll just stop that. Do we know what's going to happen with the helper? this in the shop. So it's under disc cultivators or disc harrows and it's at the end here 84,380 pounds 18k working speed 12 meter width 380 horsepower and no options on wheels or anything like that but a nice simple working mod. One of the more expensive ones as well unfortunately it's only for PC because obviously Kivon is not an in-game brand but that's where I'll be leaving this video it's another good mod for us to have a go with in-game on these bigger tractors but for now I'm going to say thank you for watching if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you again in the next one Goodbye for now.